long time no vlog. It has been a hot minute. So um, this weekend I decided I wanted to do the um, Read What You Want 24 hour readathon that Stephanie Leanne Bookish is doing. So the book that I am attempting to read this weekend is La Mort d'Arthur by Sir Thomas Mallory. So this is a hefty book. So this is, let's see, basically a thousand pages. It's 938 pages, which is going to be great. So basically I'm just trying to read as much as humanly possible for this readathon because there are just a lot of things that are preventing me from reading um, for like the full 24 hours. So this morning I had to work and I ended up um, having to stay late, so it's actually almost two o'clock, and I haven't had lunch yet, so I'm starving. So I'm gonna gonna get lunch first. So I have to do that. I have a paper due next Friday that I need to work on, and I work tomorrow. So technically, the readathon starts tonight at nine, but I work tomorrow morning, so I have to go to bed at nine o'clock. <laughs> so I am not gonna start then. I'm gonna start now kind of thing. And then tomorrow night I have a wedding to go to, so I'm gonna do that. And then I also need to go out and get a Valentine's Day gift for my boyfriend. So I'm gonna do that with my brother. So it's gonna be some breaks and it's not gonna be totally finished, but we're gonna do it. I'm gonna get as much done as humanly possible if I can. But first, lunch. So it is many hours later. I am now in a face mask. I'm sorry. I look like a ghost. <laughs> um, it is 20 to 8 and you might be thinking, wow Megan, that is super early to be clearly in bed and getting ready for sleep. Um, and I would have to say, no, it is not <laughs> that early because I'm going to bed at 9 because I have to be up at 4 a.m. tomorrow for work. So, this is, we're right on schedule. This is perfect for me. This is normal. <laughs> um, so, it is many hours after I first told you I'd be reading, and not a lot of reading got done. A lot of other stuff had to happen in there, but I'm now in bed. We got the face mask on. We'll be reading. So, as I said, I'm reading La Mort d'Arthur, and I am on page... 33, which doesn't sound like a lot, but it is something that was written in 1460, I think it was, and so the style of writing is a little bit more difficult to get into, just the way it was written and everything, um, and I haven't read something like this in many years, um, since I was in my undergrad. So it's been about three or four years and it's a little bit difficult to get back into and right now there's like a war going on and there's a lot of he saw his ally was on horse so he went and killed somebody and then gave his ally the horse and that ally saw somebody else was without a horse and killed somebody and gave them the horse. It's like that. It was like, there were like two pages of that. So I'm kind of like, that's great. <laughs> And especially when you know that, like, Thomas, Thomas Mallory was in jail when he read this. He had nothing but time. So he, like, this was just taking up time for him. So it explains a lot <laughs> about how it was written and, like, the descriptions. It's because he didn't really care. He had nothing but time. So what was he going to do other than write? So we'll see. We're going to get into it. I'm going to do some more reading. I will maybe see you before I go to bed. I will definitely see you tomorrow. Hi everyone! So it is Saturday and it is 10.50. Um, sorry, there's like the light. Okay. So it's kind of early-ish. Not really. I've already been to work. I was almost late actually this morning. <laughs> 
my alarm didn't go off, so I woke up at 4.20, and I was like, oh my god, I need to go to work. And then I did some more reading last night. So I'm now on page 41, which is not much further than it was last night. This book is just very difficult to get distracted from. It's very dense and intense, and a lot's happening, like, a lot has happened in these 40 pages, and... Yeah, it's a little bit crazy. So I'm trying to stay trying to stay interested in it. It's difficult, but we're gonna do it. So today I need to have a shower, obviously. <laughs> um, I need to go out shopping for Valentine's Day stuff, so shower shopping. Um, I need to do some errands and then I want come up with a topic for my topic paper that I have on Friday and I need to do some more reading and then nine o'clock is the wedding it's technically a reception that we're going to so I don't know we're gonna be leaving hi it is Sunday so it is like quarter after five 20 after five at night yeah <laughs> So the wedding was fine last night. We didn't get home till one o'clock. We didn't go to bed till one o'clock um, because it was out ways. It was like an hour away from where I lived. So then by the time we got home and everything, it was like dead. Didn't wake up until like ten o'clock this morning. And then I had to go meet up with some uh, classmates to go work on an assignment, which is due this week. So that needed to be done. So that's fine. And then. Um, it was like five hours. I spent five hours working on assignment and I'm home. So I've done no reading today. But I am on page 58. I'm on page 58 now of the Lord Arthur. So I've done, I did some reading yesterday, but nowhere near where I would like to be. So tonight we're just going to read and we're just going to go and I will update you guys before I go to bed tonight. Hi guys! So it is Monday. Obviously I did not update you guys last night before I went to bed. It was just getting late and I wanted to quickly get to the milestone that I wanted to in my book. And yeah, I had to work this morning so I didn't want to be up too late. So I didn't really want to spend the time to update you guys when I could spend that reading. So I did reach a milestone. And that is, I got to page 100. And that, <laughs> that is my milestone. So I'm still only one ninth of the way in, basically. 938 pages. So not as far as I would like to be. But again, I hit 100 pages. Woo! So that is my milestone for the readathon. There is a, another readathon next weekend this coming weekend that I want to participate in so I might do it again to like try to push my way through but we'll see anyway that is my update that is my readathon I will see you guys in the next video bye